Hey guys, it's Isaac from Bacon Bros, and today I'm going to be doing a video on how to clean your saxophone and its mouthpiece. Um, I haven't uploaded in a while, so I figured it'd be a good thing to do, um, just because I need to do it anyways. So, what you need is you need your saxophone. I have mine here. You need your reeds, um, because to played after whatever I don't know you need your neck of your saxophone and then your neck strap which is in my belt so what I have done previously is I have boiled some water and I have the mouthpiece that came with my saxophone that came with my saxophone um, I boiled that mouthpiece um, I don't use this mouthpiece Oh. Yeah, I don't use this mouthpiece, but um, it's, well, I don't, I don't know. I've never used it because I've never came around to actually, um, I've, eh, let me I'll show you guys better. I've never really came around to doing it. So, what you need is you need a cleaning rod to clean your neck out with, a little plushy thing to clean the keys and stuff, uh, one of these to clean inside, like the pads and stuff, important your mouthpiece cleaning swab, and then the mouthpiece cover, not really, and then ligature, which is, yeah. I'll be back. I need to so I'm back I have my ligature and everything's good so what you guys want to do is you want to take the mouthpiece that's in your boiling water and I've already cleaned it and stuff dang it and then what you come on. and then what you want to do is put it in a cup of vinegar slash water half vinegar and half water and let that sit for a little bit um I don't know what I should do while we're waiting. I guess I can take a, on a tour of my backyard, because why not? This is our like main place that we sit outside in. Huh, that's weird. I guess I shot an airsoft BB, and it indented inside of the cactus. That's weird. Okay some trees, air conditioning. This is our backyard shed, a furnace, more backyard stuff. We got a bunch of plants over here and a table, some more plants. Nice grass area. I've been meaning to weed eat but we eat, but um, when I had the electrical cable and we did it in the grass because I was trying to pull more line through it last night and it's the sprinklers came on so I had to let everything dry out. I have my turtle. He's in that little enclosure right there. A tiny little cactus up there. I'm growing some sunflowers. A bunch of huge sunflowers and then some baby ones. We have some basil. Well, it looks like lavender, I want to say. Yeah, rosemary, some more basil, and some aloe. And then that's a blackberry bush and a sign thing. And some more blackberries. This is our garden. We have a bunch of tomatoes. We have a bell pepper here. And we have some sweet banana peppers here some green bell peppers uh, what do we have here we have kohlrabi and then over here we have zucchini which looks dead which it is we have our rototiller um, a bunch of tools we got a mower 
and some stuff, a gate and another rototiller, a uh, push lawnmower, cat trap, a keg, <laughs> a dolly, and a plant. I believe that's lemongrass. I don't know though. I do not know what that plant is right there, but, and then I have a grass area. This is where I keep my rabbits when I have rabbits. Um, I auctioned them off at the fair recently. I got best of breed with my Rex the past two years. Um, yeah. So, maybe it's clean. What we're going to do is pour some of this liquid out, and yeah, okay, so we have that. We're just going to dump Mr. Mouthpiece out right there, and then you can't play a mouthpiece that has vinegar on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move all of this crap stuff, whatever, I'm going to move all this stuff. I don't want to move the mouthpiece. I'm going to move this. Okay, now I can set you guys up. Here we go. I believe you can see me here. I'm going to go turn on my hose. Okay, so I have my hose and my mouthpiece. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just spray it down with some water. Can you guys see this? Okay, I'm stupid. There's a sink, um, like right behind the camera. So that's stupid of me, I just forgot about that. So we're just going to keep rinsing it off, maybe get the jet setting. Pleasant. Maybe it's yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Well, it cleans. Then maybe just mist it off and all that good stuff. back to our first setting. Okay, as I turn off this thing, as I turn off the sprinkler, I forget that I need a towel to dry this down with. I'm gonna go get that. Okay, so, okay, we're still doing good. I was checking my battery level because my battery is about to die. So, I have my mouthpiece here. All I need to do, what is that? It's weird, there's some weird substance on the side. Whatever, okay. So we wash it down, there's probably no vinegar left. We're just gonna swab it in, to, just to make sure it's clean. 
and then do the same with your neck. Just take this and then slide it on through. And then pull it back. Oh, that's dirty. Oh, oh, that's dirty. Okay, I'm going to make a future episode on how to clean your neck because I just realized this is really dirty. Okay. And then if you want to, you can just clean your mouth, your um, saxophone. But what I'm going to do is just dry the whole mouthpiece off itself. Uh, blah, 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 um, swab it a few more times just to be sure it's clean. Um, okay. Next, get your reed. I use a synthetic reed, but I also have a wood reed just for backup. So, while I'm sucking on my reed, I'm going to put my saxophone together. I'm kind of worried about using this mouthpiece because I don't know. I just don't know. That's weird. Okay, it has a wider width than my other mouthpiece. Strange. Cuckoo. Really unloosening this ligature screw. R ooh. I haven't had such a hard time trying to do this before. Just pull down on the reed a tad. Seems to be good there. Then we pull down on the ligature and then just tighten things up a tad bit. Okay. Let me check how much battery I got. Oh, all right, eight percent. We're good. Just for a tiny bit longer. So, ooh, this sex. Mm. This mouthpiece feels weird. <coughs> Definitely. Okay. Never. surprisingly but it is clean and um, <laughs> seems to work well everything is cooperating the mouthpiece doesn't seem dirty at least now I have to go and clean my other one because yeah so thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video